today I have a five pin Yale uh, rim cylinder from uh, the package I opened earlier from uh, my brother uh, steel pennies that I said I would uh, open uh, but I ran out of time uh, opening up this package and as I promised uh, I would do so uh, now so I want to thank everyone for uh, tuning in the Bronx Stock Picker 60 as I said so I don't believe it's a challenge lock but I can make one out of this bidding. I mean, it's not too bad. So, top of the keyway. And come on, baby, focus. And let's begin. Go to the rear. Okay, that was five. We got me a nice deep fall set. lost it and there we go so I went from five to three and back to five so let's see if I can uh, get my penning tray in here without moving too much hey buddy hey that's my one of my buddies one of my cats uh, Salvatore Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to move my uh, my uh, my pinning tr or my my vice. Hey, Sal, what you doing, buddy? Excuse me. Let's put this in here. Ah. Uh, as quick as that open, I'm sure it's uh, nothing special inside, but I love my Yales. And the keys are in here somewhere. Uh, ah, here it is. Try not to uh, lock it, so let's uh, let's do what we do here. Oops, don't lock it there, Jimbo. And I'm not going to sham it. Here we go. Let's see what we got here. Here we go. They all needed to be picked except for uh, uh, number five and it looks like it has a natural I don't know how to consider that counter milling but as you can see it's if I show it to you like that you can see it's like a little bevel around there they all do so Let me go down like that. Let's see what we got. I'll start up here. Standard one, standard two, three is standard, four is standard, five is standard, and as I said, this 
there isn't anything done to the Bible other than guess the it's manufacturing uh, type bevel that it has there. I don't expect anything spectacular in the uh, in the Bible, but it means we got that full set. Who knows? Okay, one was standard with a uh, copper spring. Aha. A nice little spool in number two with a same type of copper spring. So that's why it gave us a full set, obviously. Come on, baby. And standard and three with the same copper spring. Don't run away. Number four is another uh, another spool with a copper spring, and let's go the other way. Excuse me. And five is standard, and I assume. A copper spring and obviously nothing down to the Bible not yet this will make a perfect challenge lock steel pinnings thanks so much for this beautiful Yale and all the neat stuff man you sent me awesome awesome let's get a close-up of yeah, it's standard, but not bad, not bad. So in one, we have a standard with a standard driver and a copper spring. Number two is a standard key pin with a uh, spool driver with a copper spring. Number two, uh, standard key pin with a standard driver and a copper spring. Number four, <clears throat> a standard key pin with a driver, uh, with, cop, uh, with a uh, spool driver, copper spring, and standard, standard, and the same copper spring. And let's show you this. As you can see, let me, if I back out of it a little bit, you can see that one, one lip of the spool is thicker than the other, like the top one is thicker than the, than the bottom. So you can actually put these either way, but I would prefer putting a uh, putting a thinner side uh, thinner side facing into the core especially if I'm th threading it or uh, uh, counter milling it what's up Papa what's up buddy but anyway as I promised I want to share this with you uh, thanks a lot again still pennings for this and all the awesome locks uh, thank everyone uh, for watching. Uh, please uh, share, like, subscribe. And my buddy Sal says hi. <laughs> and uh, stay safe, stay legal, and as always, stay calm and pick on. Thanks everyone for watching. Bye-bye.